into this week's discussion of Vanderpump Rules. Oh boy, Stassi is getting down into the E on her love tank. You know that she is getting desperate because without Katie, she's down to Christina and the married ones. Ooh, that baby though. Who's watching that baby? They show up at her house and they're drinking champagne with gold in it. What is this, super bad? <laughs> Who the hell is going to buy her statement necklaces? I don't know. She's got this line of necklaces now, and she doesn't have friends to buy them, so... What would you think of that display? With all of her horrible paintings. They're all like... It was like an altar of crap. Did she grow up with a staticky TV, and it's like... <laughs> it's just ingrained in her mind? Does I don't she have that. a lot of migraines? I don't know, but... Take if me you're to into Sir. that, yeah, she <laughs> is giving Christina uh, a ride to Sir, but in exchange, she wants that takeout, and she wants it now. Does she not cook? I don't think so. Does she have anything else to do besides drive uh, Kate, uh, bleh, Christina around? Mm -mm. All right, well, <laughs> Lisa's pretty happy. She feels a little accomplished that there wasn't any drama on the Miami trip. She yeah. finally did something right. Usually, they come back from these group trips, and everyone's just like, bleh. Yeah, if... Katie had been the object of drama, Lisa would have been pissed because, like, she pretty much told Skiana, girl, you better bring, <laughs> you better take Katie with you. Great, Lisa. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, so she's proud of Katie for going and having a good time with these people. Well, the whole Jack's Veil thing was a fail, as far as we know. Yeah, uh, she doesn't even remember what happened, so maybe something did happen. Who knows? <gasps> a blackout's God's way of saying, forget about it. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh-oh, is there something going on with Peter and Vale? Peter the pirate? Well... They're looking awfully flirty. They're having a little flirt manse, but I think that's where it ends. Well, Peter talks a really big game. He's like, yeah, I'm, like, getting with all these girls, but I'm thinking I want to settle down and, and get a girlfriend or something. Well, Vale gets drunk and makes out a lot, but she's really not into Peter. Yeah. <laughs> well, I just think it's funny that Peter is, like, talking this big game, but then everyone else is just like, Peter sucks. <laughs> He's got nothing. Yeah, so Peter asks Vale out for coffee. And it doesn't uh, end up being coffee. It's wine. Yeah. Let's get a bottle. Whoa, wait a minute. <laughs> what? I think she was going to work after that, too. She was. It, and his idea of turn-ons is staring at ladies like this. <laughs> was he watching that uh, show about science and love where they do those experiments where you have to like stare at someone for like four minutes? Uh, I don't know. Because that's what it seemed like and it was really awkward. I think he stole a part of her soul. Well, she was really freaked out and needless to say that date did not end well. <sighs> she actually pulled out, stop being so awkward. <laughs> that's pretty bad. Yeah. All right, so Jax meets up with Carmen. He takes the uh, initiative and pre-orders her a trough of food. All right. And she's like, great, thank you. You know what? They're both going to be at Sheena's wedding, and they're probably going to be sitting at the same table. So Jax wants to make sure he's got some something or someone to do after the wedding. <laughs> Everybody's getting something. Yeah. So he He's trying to patch things up. Drops a truth bomb. And to all of us, because I'm sure he already and she already knew it, that they each are the best sex of each other's lives. We really didn't need to know that. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> did she actually say that, or did he assume that he was the best? You can't trust anything that comes out of this guy's mouth, so who knows? All right, well, she says, stop texting me. Remember when he was like, yeah, I'm texting her uh, on this Miami trip. I'm texting Carmen and the other one, See Tiffany. See which one responds first. Guess what? She don't want to go out with you while you're still pseudo going out with somebody else. Yeah. Or maybe you're really going out with them. She was like, uh, didn't you see what I was texting back? I was saying, leave me alone. Go talk to your girlfriend. Did you break up with your girlfriend? Eh? That was a big no. He was noncommittal on that one. And I don't blame her for running the other way. She did, right? Did she, though? I don't know. It kind of seems like it could still happen, honestly. <sighs> She's not bringing a date to the wedding, so anything goes. All right, let's talk about Kristen. She's 
What? She totally misinterpreted her Miami chat with Tom. He was basically like, I want you to be happy. Go live your life. And she took that as, he still cares about me. You know what she needs? Relationship Rosetta Stone. Yeah. <laughs> she needs to know when people are like, get the F away from me. I never want to go out with you again. Well, yes, now, we had something, but it's over now. Yeah, now she's thinking, well, if Ariana's out of the picture, then I'll have a chance. I'll get back with Tom. Screw James. She kind of tries to talk to James about this, too, and he's just like, Ew. He's sick of that shit. Uh, kind sort of. of. <laughs> All right. Well, guess who's coming to L.A.? <gasps> Miami girl. What? Uh -oh, she wants dog. to see the look on Tom's face when she walks into Sir. I don't think Lisa's going to be too happy about I, that. I don't think she wants her employees bringing their drama to her place of business, so no. All right, well, let's patch things up, Katie and Stassi. Or We're having a meeting of the half-wits. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to discuss their friendship and what went wrong. Stassi's expecting an apology out of all this. Yeah, she's like, oh, she's I'm just I'm ready for a great apology. Bring it on. Katie, she got some grow a backbone. She's like, hell no, you're walking all over me, I'm sick of it, this relationship was not equal. I didn't used to like Katie, and now I freaking love her! Yeah, I'm like, Katie, Katie. Katie. <laughs> all right, She stood so, up for herself, and it was awesome. There's no resolution there, and there were tears. Ha ha, Stassi! Next week, it's gonna get crazy! Oh my gosh, the Miami girl shows up, and... Sheena and Kristen are fighting, and it's just like, <gasps> oh, craziness. Crap. <sighs> so let us know in the comments what you guys thought of this episode. It was interesting. Are Jax and Carmen going to get back together? Are Tom and uh, Kristen going to get back together? <laughs> Maybe in Bizarro World. <laughs> yeah, so let us know what you thought. And until next time, much, much love. love. Edit. 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 Edit.